happy to be with you to talk a few minutes about Parashat Miketz. I think it's a very exciting parasha because we're talking about the uh, unition of the brothers that have come to Yosef and uh, finally they'll be united and they're all called Achei Yosef because he's the one who unites them. And we see that finally uh, all his dreams, the dreams that he dreamt as a teenager, are all uh, coming to be accomplished. Um, he's the mashbir. He's the one who's uh, financing the whole country. He actually has put in his warehouses so much uh, stuff that he, he, would, he would just wait uh, for the right time to use it. And, uh, and, and it's actually, we see that what's happening is that his dreams, his dreams of the corn ears and his dreams of the stars that were all um, um, around uh, this, this uh, around him is actually his brothers who just come to, uh, and they're they're coming in because of starvation in, 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 into Egypt, and he is the one who's actually um, taking care of them, financing them, and saving their lives. And the whole matter of Yosef at Tzaddik is in one hand, he's really a tzaddik, and the other hand, he's work. He, he actually is part of the, of the, the noble world, of the, of the natural world. And, uh, and the fact that he's, uh, he put in his, his warehouses so much um, stuff is, is actually a part of his being a tzaddik. And we know that Rebbe Mechabed Ashirim, it's, it's said that Rebbe, or Be'udan Asi, honors rich people. Because if God gave these people money, he understands that they, they deserve that money and they have a lot of responsibility, but it's something we have to honor. Just like if somebody, if God gave someone beauty, there's a special bracha, if God saves so, someone uh, uh, a lot of, uh, uh, a, a lot of um, uh, wealth or a lot of um, wisdom or whatever, we know that it's something we have to honor. So it's many times we think that the, the tzaddik that we want to be is like that tzaddik is just living in a different uh, level and just learning Torah and doesn't even know how to deal with the everyday situation. And we see here that Dafka Yosef was called Yosef HaTzaddik. He's in the normal natural situation and he mekadesh the natural situation and he brings it to high levels of achdut, of a, unity where the, uh, all the 12 tribes are united and uh, it's actually the beginning of a, of, of, of a united nation and uh, I think we have a lot of to, to learn about from Yosef in terms of unition. Un, uh, we, this is an era where we have to be united. The whole world is united around this uh, corona business and Am Yisrael especially has to be united and when we're united all the blessings can just come through. Should be a nice Shabbat Shalom, Parashat Miketz, Dr. Hanakata.